Antonia Fazan. Good morning. Good morning. You are from Newport? Uh, I live in Edgewood now, but I'm from Newport originally. And what do you do? I'm a reporter at the Providence Journal. Mm -hmm. Oh, I read your byline a lot. Oh, thank you. I do. And you have a school zone violation on Only Street. What do you want to tell me about that? Um, so what happened in that case was I was taking my cat to the vet. He actually got um, attacked by another cat in the neighborhood, and he was yelling and crying a lot. So I'm usually very careful, but I must have gone a little too fast. He goes to City Kitty, which is right around the corner there on Hope and Olney. Yeah. Um, so he was just making a lot of noise and being really upset, and I ended up with a $500 vet bill. So I figured I would come in and see if I could get a break because I otherwise have never had any violations like this. <laughs> a $500 vet bill? Yeah, because this other cat who's like the, like the menace of the neighborhood bit his paw and it got infected, so he had to have some surgery. How old is your cat? Um, I think he's about six years old, but I don't, I don't actually really know. Yeah. What's, what was the cat's name? Um, his name is Sage. I have a photo here. Let me see. Like Let's see the photo. His name is Sage, but we call him a uh, Sagebrush. Oh, it's a beautiful cat. What's the name tag say? Is that the cat's name? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and my phone number, just in case he goes missing. Yeah. In the law office, there's a, one of my cousins uh, has a dog, and his name is Gage. Mm. So Gage is part of the law office. You know, Gage is there. He's the boss of the office, actually. Has he made partner yet? His percentage was too high. He, he, <laughs> he wanted eighty percent of the profits <laughs> when negotiating. When negotiating that, anyway. Well, you're an animal lover, which helps you here because we uh, we are very partial to certain things. Animals are, are one mm. of those. Okay. What's the most difficult uh, interview you did as a journalist? Hmm. Um, I mean, I'm sure you know it's always tough dealing with people who have been charged with some kind of crime, um, who have done something yeah. bad. So I, I can't think of one in particular, yeah. but in general, when you have to knock on people's doors because that, they've been accused of something, it's never fun. Usually, uh, I'm not sure, I don't, you probably weren't there that long, but people who were interviewing uh, victims of the station fire, that was mm. probably the most difficult. Most yeah. difficult, uh, we actually have the anniversary coming up in, in February, the 20th in, in, anniversary, so unfortunately we're going to have to yeah, that, um, revisit all that again. Yeah. That's definitely really tough, any kind of victim. Well, this one's going to be on Sage, so we're going <laughs> we're gonna to dismiss the case. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I mean, Sage gets a treat when you get home. Tomorrow. I will. I'll make sure he gets his best treats. <laughs> Good luck to you. Okay. Thank you very much.